right here as we get into Thursday afternoon, Thursday evening, we could potentially finally be seeing a good amount of snow through the central to southern Rockies here. I know you guys have been waiting for this for quite a while. And we see the slow pressure beginning to eject through the plains here. This is going to bring, obviously, some rainfall into Texas, Oklahoma, Missouri, Arkansas. But what's behind this is interesting because we could see this trough beginning to tilt. We could see a storm system beginning to form. And maybe we have a snowstorm through the plains here. Watch as we get into Friday morning. That first storm system moves off into the northeast. And we start to get kind of a funnel of moisture up from the Gulf through portions of Dixie Alley and the Ohio Valley. We push into Friday evening. And suddenly you can see our trough is beginning to tilt. And we're trying to get a storm system that forms right along this boundary. Now, we're pretty cold out west. We're warm in the southeast. And we still have this funnel of moisture. There is going to be some severe potential here Friday into Saturday. We're going to have to watch as this develops. It really all depends how amplified is this trough. How much does this trough try to dig and tilt and pull this moisture and create this instability out ahead of it? As we move forward in time here through Saturday, you can see we start to get a neutrally, maybe negatively, but I think neutrally tilted trough, and we get a nice snowstorm here. Could drop some snow through portions of Kansas, Nebraska, northern Missouri, Iowa, Minnesota, Wisconsin. We'll have to see. It's tough to tell how far south this system wants to go or if it wants to tilt a little bit earlier. And if that happens, the southern portion, you're just rain. This could end up just being a snowstorm for Nebraska, portions of northwestern Iowa, Minnesota. The models are struggling with the timing of this system coming off the Pacific. So let's watch this closely over the next 24 hours because, again, we see where this snow wants to fall right now. This could easily go a little bit farther south, shift a little bit farther north. But depending on when the storm system begins to tilt, begins to intensify, we could end up seeing some significant severe weather Friday into Saturday. So I'll watch this closely as it develops.